The only sound was the slow popping of the embers in the fire, and he was struck yet again by how very quiet it was out here. In the city, there was no such thing as silence. Just like wherever you went, you were never really alone. It was something he'd always taken for granted up until now. I hate this, he said finally, without making a conscious decision to say the words. All of it. I wish I'd never found out what I am. You have a gift, Shy. Shy shook his head, tipping his face down so his hair fell forward over his eyes. It doesn't feel that way to me. Lorne shook his head slightly and threw the leaf he was holding into the fire. It seems that way because all you've seen so far are the negative aspects of it. You have the ability to see so much more of life than most anyone else can. Even myself. You sound like you're jealous. Shy couldn't help grinning a little at the thought of anyone being jealous of him. Lorne's eyes glinted softly with amusement as they met his. Maybe I am. Towards the horizon, there was a low rumble of thunder, distant yet but threatening. Shy's eyes were drawn toward it despite himself. He shivered, wishing for a blanket. It's cold. It's just for tonight. We'll reach sanctuary tomorrow. Lorne paused, as if debating whether he wanted to continue. Shy, I hope you know I'm not planning on touching you tonight. I don't want you to be afraid of me. I'm not. Much. (laughs) 